options. He could have one-timed it himself. Maybe there was some room there, short side. Uh, Pasternak scores from DeBrusk. And the Bruins have come back to lead. And Jake DeBrusk again with a terrific pass. Once they step inside the offensive zone, this is a nice entry. And Nylander going after it. William Nylander in a 19-point streak. Matthew scores! Number 26! Oh. And he scored every way possible! What a sick play that is on the sideboard. It looked like the second as he was coming around, he might go back to the point. And his little adjustment just throws Samuelson, or pardon me, Skinner. He was expecting it to go, and then the quick turnaround on Samuelson right through the legs of Dalene. And terrific chance. That's a great shot and a great that's save. Beautiful oh, that's... little pass by Hyman. That came dangerously close to too many men. Snatched away, McDavid makes the move! Tucks it home for the equalizer! McDavid somehow makes it work! Unbelievable. I mean, he just put on the Jets chance after chance, and this is usually what happens when you start to get these types of sequences. And what a deke around the pad. I mean, he literally just tucks that around the right pad of Lion. Damn. Couldn't get to it cleanly. Now Patterson behind the net. Stump chance, he scores! Patterson, the Swede, is stronger than Ajo, the Finn. Good puck retrieval from Vancouver, like Carolina had on their goal a minute ago. That's as quick of a wrap as you're gonna see. But still waiting for one to count. Tavares. Drop for Nylander. He assisted on the power play. Go in! Scores! A beauty! Just like overtime! But this is just the end of a period and a player just taking the game in to his own hands. Nice job of Tavares taking a body with him. I love the fact that once he sees the middle taken away, gets it to the outside, uses his edge as well, and gets it around Gustafson. Top line also on the ice for this Avalanche team. He'll back in. McCarr darting him with a backhand shot. He scores! Kale McCarr! He again works it around the defense, but this time a backhand. Top shelf. And that was an absolute thing of beauty. Just when you think you haven't seen a Kale McCarr highlight yet, you haven't loved He comes in and buries a backhand. Right side. Stick check there by Sergeant. Now Gutra trying to pull away. Nikita Kucherov up the middle, one on one with CC. Scores! Nikita Kucherov! What a goal! When everything is going sideways and backwards, great players come through. Look at them fight through, literally fight through to get to this spot. So hard to defend. Cody CC thinks, what do I have to do except use a rope on this guy? Kucherov's concentration on the puck is simply outstanding. Drop it for nerves. One time on Dreisaitl from an impossible angle. Dreisaitl has goals in three straight games, 17 on the year. The Oilers up by a deuce. That was his best chance on the shift. He had that great block right into the middle. It just opened up. Everybody parted, and he had a real good look blocker side on Gibson. For Leon Dreisaitl, he just gets lost into that corner. After all that flurry happened, Torrey Crew gave it away to Pedersen. He passed. Miller's alone. Short-handed, T.T. Miller scores! Pedersen is able to come up with the puck right there. It's right on his tape. A saucer pass. Miller holds for long enough to get Billington down. And then the backhand finish. Group just puts him right on the tape of Pedersen. And the Cucks pile up the goals. And he walks by mid. Right to the tape of Nathan McKinnon. Down the left wing this time. McKinnon, forehand, save, score! Nathan McKinnon took it all the way to the front of the house to deliver the goods. Hart had it covered, but not caught it up. And he was flying. Well, Nathan McKinnon is now scored or assisted on the Avalanche last six goals. He's really put this team on his back right now. Comes across. So much speed, Carter Hart just buried back into his net. And in front of him on this unit here with Jack and Lou. Unbelievable. A lot caught it free from Larkin, who is barking at the referee as he heads out for a new stick. Jack Hughes swooping in. Got it. Sharp angle. Scoop! Here comes Jack Hughes, high stepping. Backs off Mo Sider below the goal line. Goalies, close your side door. And if you don't, the elite players like Jack Hughes. 
will take advantage of that daylight as he did there. Hughes going to try to get to the bench, though he's not. He's going to try to defend, but McDavid's behind him. He's in. He deeps. He scores. Shakes the shoulders and then goes to his backhand. What a pass, though. And he gets a step. He takes it. Hughes doesn't want to get the stick into the hands too much. And the Smith can't get across with that left hand. Doing what he does best. He's taking 26. Now here's a lead pass. Kim Hughes to win the game. Scores! Who would have thought it'd be the defenseman? Well, with this guy. <laughs> and watch Hughes as Miller draws everyone towards him. And then go. All alone, Quinn, and in. Oshnock with the puck on his hip and scores! Torture Chamber. He's going to slow it down right between the hash marks. This might be his best move. He certainly likes it. The pump fit, get the goaltender to fight a little bit, just enough to get down into that butterfly and then elevate. Leafs have the puck. So no harm, no foul there. Here's Matthews. Last block scores. Beautiful goal by Austin Matthews. Rager tries to jump company and it goes right for Matthews. But the third pairing of the Flames on the ice with Austin Matthews. And that's not a fair match when you get the most dangerous goal scorer in the game. There are no passengers in this game for either team. Here's Pedersen in. Elias Pedersen, nice move. Scott gives it a rebound, tucks it in. What a play. Elias Pedersen got his own loose puck and took it backhand to forehand from below the goal line to tuck it in and make it 4-2. Oh, the nicest goal you'll see tonight. Pedersen with the dangles, the shot, the rebound, and the finish. Sends up ice, gets it back, holds it in that pocket, skips it, gets it, and Pedersen on fire. 13 on the air. Matthews. Throws on a hit, knocked down. Loose puck goes to Nealander, running and scores! What a move by William Nealander! And that's how you keep it going. Highlight real stuff from William Nealander. That acceleration out of a pile, and then the strength. He shrugs off Anderson. Doesn't impact at all. Pulls it around Vladar and tucks it home. He's cut off by Taves in a brilliant defensive play. Banged ahead, and McKinnon's got a breakaway to win it in overtime. He scores! Nathan McKinnon wins it in overtime, and the comeback is complete. Well, McKinnon thought he was going to have a two on O coming in. He was almost. Look at him, he's like, Devon Days, you gonna join me? What are you gonna do? He keeps looking left, and last second just comes in and buries it. Hughes got his breather, he's back on the ice. Here he goes. He's the NHL's point leader now with nine. He cuts inside, and he scores! A game winner! <laughs> and a four-point <laughs> night ends with an exclamation point! Well, this kid is something else. Look at Jack Hughes just survey the situation and look at this shot using Ryan Pollock as a screen cuts to the middle and rips it look at that cross body I, I mean pinpoint accuracy you know Jack was looking around who's with him what is he going to do and he says I'm going to take care of this myself and he ends it Poke three by Kane and now oh, McDavid what a spin the recovery the shot is it's not real! Oh, I'll tell you, we've watched him for so many years. The way he works in the offseason on edge control, spin aramas, everything he can do. And he goes down, spin arama, pops back up, and somehow that puck was loose. It's like a whack a mole. You thought he was gone, yeah. and he just popped right back up. As it goes by him, squats right in and shoots at a sprawling, a sprawling block by Riley. Picked up by Nylander. Game with Tavares, William Nylander, on Johansson defending. Here comes Nylander, tries and scores! William Nylander! William Nylander, the star of the show all week long with a spectacular overtime rush. And Nylander just looking, where's my forward? There he is, Marcus Johansson. He can't pick him with me. Stick that leg out, drive across, and he reads the poke check. <laughs> the Nylander family. Michael, did you see that? That's my boy! A pharmaceutical.
Pasternak scores! Cross ice pass from Zaka. This is a three zone goal. After the save by Omar, get down into that one D one timer, just rips it before Levi can get across. Another great back check by Pierre Engvall there, showing his speed, speeding with his own coming back. Dotson turned it over. Matthew scores again! Tough turnover for the Islanders. They have it right now defensively. That's something they've been trying to clean up. Noah Dobson is trying to make a pass. He's got somebody right on him. He fans on it. That's a perfect example. You're in the D zone. You, they have some fresh legs coming on. You've got the best goal score in the league bearing down, and you've got a... Burbage takes the puck wide on Bennett. Burbage oh. finishes it back across the grade. Then he gets it right back to down to him. Now Edmund with a shot. Bennett scores! Nikita Kucherov, the 300th goal of his career. This was key. Edmund just gets it back towards the nice... The net, excuse me. Paul gets a stick on it, and then Kucherov going the opposite direction is able to put it underneath Bobrovsky for his first mistake of the game. Nesson dumps one ahead, hoping Miller can get there first. He does, he scores! What a play by Brock Besser to angle that one off the corner boards. Miller there puts it home on the backhand. The buzzword was strong start to the season. And a strong start to this hockey game. Miller's in behind everybody. Right up top, a backhand chip. Force back. Bouchard to dry sidle. What timer score! Nick David from the spot where dry sidle usually buries it. The level. Connor McDavid finds that quiet ice, literally on the goal line, and beats Bobrovsky to the short side with a great one time. They move it. Puck is centered, broken up, and here's Heroic to Pedersen, trying to win it in overtime. Elias Pedersen, keeps, scores! He stuck it through the legs of Jerry. What an amazing performance this is, but then has the wherewithal to punch it up the ice, and Crosby comes all the way back, but Pedersen's able to protect the puck, a brilliant play, and the Canucks withstand that late time goal. Navarro's in front, and Kima Cross and jumps the stick of Neil Andrew. Regains control of it, does his near side. William Nylander scores! Top corner! Oh, man. You know, there's a guy who's just been so consistent all year and confident with the puck. Another example of uh, Nylander with his hat the whole time and just right over the shoulder. He's going to try to fight his way, got out. Here's Drouin. Drops it for Ranton to McKinnon. Holes, look! Dangle shoots and scores! Nathan! Nathan! Slides it right past Jones. He stopped, waited, popped, and put it in the back of the net. Up his back foot. But to get that much inertia off of your back heel, post in and over the glove through a screen, that's McKinnon magic at its mind. From up top to Ryan Nugent Hopkins. McDavid towards the net. Sharp Bengals shot. And in game number 600 of his NHL career. I mean, that's what Connor McDavid does here. He attacks so quickly once he gets this puck. And he's so good at just elevating it tight. He floats it above Cam Talbot here. And Jack Hughes, Luke's going to peel off. Looks like he took a bit of a stick. So he changes. Brad puts the shoulder down. He changes direction. Jack Hughes, huge goal. Nasty and Jesper Brad makes a terrific pass. It's on his stick, it's off his stick, and Hughes ends it. And he beats him just under the glove over the left pad. What a win! Look at the release here from Jack Hughes. Now he gets it back to Hughes. Lots of traffic in front as Quinn Hughes cuts across the high slot. Now goes wide on center. And Hughes shoots, he scores. <laughs> his career high with his eighth of the season. Canucks open the score. This ridiculous agility here for Quinn Hughes. Again, we see him time and again just dust the forward at the top of the circle. He wheeled it up, and Minnesota able to convert off the rush. Nugent Hopkins, speaking about a pass, McDavid cuts in, waits, waits, tucks it home. Connor McDavid, a virtuoso. Absolutely ridiculous goal.
Talk about patience by Connor McDavid. Great outlet pass he just talked about. It. Watch this. Nugent Hopkins finds him up the ice. It's a two-on-one. As the Minnesota Wild get a little aggressive, but watch this patience. Stick handle, stick handle, get flurry to bite. But the patience, the skill of Connor McDavid to walk this around.